Ay, show me throw it back, baby, gon' shake it Ay, keep that shit in motion, keep it rotating Yeah, she all about a bag, ain't no time wasting Yeah, she don't want no nigga, baby, let's face it I been really feel like this in a minute Yeah, that demon's in my soul, got my image You ain't got... Okay Situation with mom Diary entry Two So, you guys know that me and my mom are not on the best terms And... Some of you guys have been asking me, like, how am I dealing with it? You know, how is it going? What's the update? Um, today is May 8th, 2021, and it is exactly 16, 6, 10 p.m. And Mother's Day is tomorrow. And I'm not going to cap y'all. It's internally, it was a battle with myself. Like, you know, am I ready to talk to her now? Do I even want to say Happy Mother's Day? Um... Do I want Jaden to talk to her? Like, just, it's, it was a whole lot, a whole lot of feelings going on, right? Because Mother's Day is coming up, and yes, I want to do something special for mom. Yes, I want to go spend time with her. Yes, I want to be with my mama. Me and my mama was like this, y'all, like besties. But because of the space that we're in, it was kind of like, what do I do? What do I say? Um, Prior to making this video... I did reach out to her maybe about a week or two weeks ago. Um, and I just wanted to talk to her. Like, give her the benefit of the doubt. You know, maybe she really doesn't understand the damage that she has caused or the effect that is taking on my life. Um, but long story short, the conversation was pretty much calling me a liar. And she, her exact words were, I don't want to do this with you right now. So we got off the phone and that was the last time I talked to her. Um, today, while I was with my hairstylist, getting my hair done, doing TikToks or whatever, and she texted me and my sister in the group chat after I've numerously told them time and time again, y'all, please stop putting me in these group chats. Like, I'm good right now. I'm working on myself. I'm trying to heal. I'm trying to decipher my feelings and get through whatever it is that I need to get through to be a better me. Um, and yet she still takes the time out of her day to put me in a group chat. And the message was, happy mothers. The message was happy mother's day to my beautiful daughters. At this point in my life, it's kind of just like, you still testing me. Because now you're trying to be passive aggressive. And not only that, you're being nice, nasty. Like, you already know what you said to me. You said you didn't want to talk. You don't want to hear me out. You don't want to understand why I feel the way I feel. Never said you had to like it. I never said you had to agree with it. But at least hear me out. You don't want to do none of that. But you can take time out of your day to tell me happy Mother's Day. And today's not even Mother's Day. It's tomorrow. Mother's Day always falls on a Sunday. Like... What? So it really just put me in a bad headspace. It really irritated my vibe. And it's just like, it's annoying, y'all. It's annoying. Because you can't tell me to leave you alone. I'm never welcome back to your house. You don't want shit to do with me. But then turn around and, and message me and go out your way to talk to me. But And then it's not even the fact of like, you going out your way to talk to me. You're going out your way to do everything else but address the situation or address what's the issue or hey may are you okay like like i'm always there for everybody else i'm always making sure everybody else good but when i'm down and out nobody really give a fuck and that shit is hurtful but now if i was to respond in this group chat which i am gonna respond if I was to respond in this group chat and be my old me and cuss her ass out and say some hurtful ass shit, now it's, oh my God, oh my God, Marie, you went too far. Oh my God, oh my God, Marie, you this. Oh my God, oh my God. But nobody gonna say nothing to the person that's at fault. Nobody's gonna say nothing to the person that's not even trying to see where they went wrong. It's just like, keep that same energy. Where's the energy when you told me me and my child wasn't walking back to your house?
Don't tell me Happy Mother's Day. I don't want it. You could have kept that shit. You could have kept that shit. Like, stop putting me in these fucking group chats. Hmm. Y'all, it's starting to get to the point where it's really about to, like, I'm beyond hurt now. Like, I was disappointed I was hurt. Yeah, okay. But this shit is really about to piss me the fuck off. Because I'm minding my own business. Me and my nigga are taking care of shit we are taking care of. I got bigger and better shit on my fucking plate than how you feel today. Like, we have so many opportunities ahead of us. I don't have time for somebody dragging me down over and over again. Like, I'm not doing that shit. I'm not, y'all. I'm not. I'm not. And this shit is so aggravating. Because I'm trying to do right. I'm trying not to, like, beat your ass. I'm trying to be the bigger person. It's never good enough. Because it's not what you want when you want it. You can't tell me how to hurt, how to heal, and how to feel. And you damn sure can't tell me how I should react to the dumb shit I just found out that you've been doing my whole 26 years of living. My whole life is a fucking lie. But I'm supposed to just, happy Mother's Day, Ma. Love you too. Fuck out of here. Because if that's love, I don't want it. I don't want it. I don't want it. I don't. And I'm really just at a place in my life where like y'all on some real street shit. I ain't got no mama. I ain't got no mama. Out of her own mouth, I should have gave her up for adoption. Done. I've been adopted. I no longer exist. keep that same fucking energy this shit is getting too much like it's becoming to be too fucking much i'm tired of always being the bigger person oh i'm not gonna say nothing i'm not gonna respond i don't want to piss nobody off i don't want to come off me i don't want them to think i'm crazy fuck all of this shit i don't give a fuck when i get done with this video i'm gonna put everything in and how i feel in a motherfucking text message i'm gonna text her ass back and i'm gonna let her ass the fuck know stop putting me in these fucking group chats i don't have shit else to say to you when i wanted to talk to you you didn't want to talk so keep that same energy why are you talking to me now keep that same energy same fucking energy miss me with that whack ass shit the fuck leave me alone cause I'm tired of motherfuckers saying shit and then being like oh I ain't mean it like that oh you took it wrong oh this oh that nah nigga you shouldn't have said it you shouldn't have fucking said it and I'm not gonna cap y'all I'm not gonna cap Look, and this is my life I did text my mama and tell her I wish she would die for real I do a lot of shit and I say a lot of shit and I move a certain way but one thing nobody could ever take away from me is what I say is what I mean and what I mean is what I say. And if I said it back then, okay, cool. I was wrong for saying that when I felt this in that moment. But at the end of the day, I'm still grown enough to do that. Motherfucker say shit, move funny, act weird. Oh, you're a liar. I don't remember that. Oh my God, did that really happen? Oh my God. No, bitch, I just pulled this shit out of my asshole. And made up all this shit in my motherfucking head. Because as y'all said, I'm crazy, right? I'm crazy, right? But ain't none of y'all successful. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Keep pushing and keep poking. And y'all gonna get what the fuck y'all looking for. Leave me the fuck alone. Yeah, she all about a bag, ain't no time wasting. Yeah, she don't want no nigga, baby, let's face it. I've been really feel like this in a minute. Yeah, that demon's in my soul, got my image. You ain't gotta trust me, baby, just listen. I know you try to hide your pain and your feelings.